Welcome back to Midco Sports tonight. Tomorrow on the red turf in Cheney, Washington, second ranked North Dakota State will take on number seven Eastern Washington. Brian Sean has the preview on this top 10 matchup. After rolling to an easy victory in week one, North Dakota State is sure to face a tougher test this week against Eastern Washington. The herd will go up against one of the top quarterbacks in the FCS and Gage Gubrud. But with a new head coach in Cheney, it's tough to know exactly what they'll see. I would think they would want to run the football a little bit more. He's an offensive uh, of line coach, and, and uh, uh, but in the same respect, they have an elite, elite quarterback that uh, I think is one of the best in FCS, so you have to put the ball in his hands as well. So I, I think this week will be a better indicator of, of what they want to do, and we have to be able to adapt and adjust. We only got one game with this new coaching staff to see uh, what they did, what they're going to do. The some things worked, some things didn't, so I'm sure they'll try to adjust that just like any team does after the first game, make adjustments. So we're going to go, we're going to watch our game from last year, obviously, and see what we can learn from. We had some defensive lapses last year that we're going to try to work on. NDSU's ground game ran for nearly 500 yards in the season opener and had great success against the Eagles in Fargo last year. The Bison now hope to carry that momentum and once again control the line of scrimmage. Like we stressed in the whole line room, you got to move the points with the running game, you know, it starts on the inside there, the D tackles and um, the, the whole D line, we got to move the move them and then we can open up some holes. We're a little bit different than we were a year ago and uh, they're a little bit different than a year ago. But, uh, uh, you know, as far as us wanting to be physical, um, when we do go out on the road and minimizing penalties, we had um, two real bad penalties this past week, unnecessary penalties that uh, uh, we can't afford to have, especially against a team like Eastern Washington. Early season injuries continue to plague NDSU, with offensive lineman Dylan Radins and running back Damaris Purifoy both going down with season-ending ACL injuries. The Bison pride themselves on the next man up mentality, and the head coach says it's just part of the game. We've been in this situation before, and uh, as Gus Bradley uh, told us three years ago when he came here, when Murphy hit, you attack Murphy, and they're all freak deals, you know, and it's not like you know, some are on grass, some are on turf, and um, I think athletes are bigger, faster, stronger at all levels. Eastern Washington is also coming in facing some adversity. The Eagles scored their lowest amount of points in a game since 2009, dropping their opening contest at Texas Tech 56-10. to We're a different team, they're a different team, they bring different, different guys back, and it's at a different venue. And we got a different taste in our mouth, so I hope that taste they want to get out uh, come Saturday. I think it's a great chance for us to send a message after a game that uh, didn't really go our way, to say the least, in Lubbock. Um, so just to go out there and, and execute and show that we are a solid team and a solid contender, uh, for a national championship run. This is a really good team. I mean, five national championships, for five national championships in a row. They're going to be coming in here looking for that dub and uh, courtesy to them. But we have to come and we got to bring our A game, take the lessons that we learned from last game and apply it to this week. Thanks, Brian. This is the first trip to Cheney for NDSU since 2010 when the Bison lost in overtime in the national quarterfinals. Needless to say, it should be a good one. When we come back, it's time for head-to-head. -head. Greg Enkers and Carla Metz go at it for a Friday finale. That's coming up next. 